Hello everybody, my name is Gleason and welcome to the very first episode in this new series called Mechanical Minecraft. In this series I'll be play playing Minecraft with a bunch of cool mods installed. These include Industrial Craft, Build Craft, Equivalent Exchange, Red Power and others. Now my game seed is mechanical or lowercase and I'm going to create this new world here. Um, first of all, I want to give a big thank you and shout out to the awesome DieWolf20. He he has a series that's been going on for a while now where he's been playing with all these mods. And so that series was the inspiration for this series, which I'm going to be doing. And it'll hopefully be a lot of fun. Uh, he has a forum thread about how to install all these mods. And so I'll link you to that in the description. Now I'm going to get started here while I pause the recording. In this series I'm not going to be showing you much of getting started uh, or much normal vanilla stuff that you guys would find boring. I'm just going to show you stuff that I'll be doing with the mods. So I'll get back to you in a bit with, a, with an update. Actually before I do that I just want to explain what's happening on my channel. Uh, as you can probably tell by this video like the recording so far, I'm having a lot of trouble with uh, Minecraft and Fraps and things like that. Um, basically, I got a new graphics card and I did a DIY external graphics card setup. So I've got a Radeon HD 6950, yeah that's it. Um, and it is using PCI thingies, complicated stuff to use it with my laptop. And it's all working well. I can play games like Skyrim on high quality, which I couldn't even play before. But Minecraft doesn't seem to like it, so I'm not sure what's going on. I'm, I'm getting a lower frame rate f from before, and yeah, so if troubles like that happen in the series, I um, ask for your patience so that I'll be able to get something out there for you guys because obviously I haven't posted any videos for a while while we've been trying to fix this and it's just being a whole calamity. And so again, I'll be back with an update. Just saying, there are a lot of flowers around here. Wow. Ooh, nice big desert. I think I'm going to set up my house here actually. I always play in deserts in creative mode but never really in survival mode and I've never really built a house out of sandstone so... I think I'm going to give that a go. Here we go, I've just walked a little way from that forest into the desert and I found an oil spawn. This is oil used in build craft uh, and you can refine it into fuel and it can be used as a fuel source as itself. Yes, yeah, so I'm glad I found that. It's going to be good for starting out, definitely in build craft. So here we are, I think I've decided to build my house in this little area here. And just made myself a workbench and I've just started digging into here and I've already found some copper. Copper is used in industrial craft and red power. Um, I'll just mention those two for now. And it can be smelted and used for cabling and things like that. Just thought I'd show off that to you guys. I also need to make a furnace as quickly as possible to cook up this meat that I got from piggies. Yes, yeah, so it looks like it's just turning night, which is not a good thing. Uh, looks like my meat's cooked by now. I've just gone and gathered a heap of sand so I can make it into sandstone. And I'll make myself a little house. I'll also cook up some wood for torches. So let's see, sand and sand. Gets me some sandstone. Yay! Vanilla Minecraft. Okay. Let's see what I can do with this. Hmm, this isn't a very good start. My sandstone didn't go very far, and I got monsters spawning everywhere. And I didn't think to kill sheep on the way, so... I'm not sure what I'm going to do. For now, I'm just going to live in this hole, and, and hopefully I don't have any monsters dropping in on my head from above. Because that would suck. Majorly. And would you look at that? Came across some ruby on my way down. Fair way down so far. The only problem is, I haven't come across any iron yet. So unfortunately, I cannot mine this ruby. 
which is sad because it's in a tier that wow tin and copper and coal <whistles> nice little patch there um ruby and sapphire and emerald and all the, those sort of gems are in a tier of tools and stuff that's between iron and diamond so it's better than iron and worse than diamond so they're they're pretty good tools to use because they're nicely abundant and I still haven't gotten any iron and it's kind of annoying because I've just found some more rubies and I think yeah that's appetite issues in forestry which is a mod that works with build craft actually I don't know if it's build craft specific but anyway it uh... it helps with a lot of farming so you can do that automatically in minecraft it looks like it's getting to day out here so I'm going to head up, I need some more wood, and i see how much more progress I can make towards building my house. And it must be raining, because the sun's not out, which is pretty depressing. You can see some massive red power trees over there. Those are humongous. That's where I came from originally, and this is where I've been getting sand from so far. So I'll just keep working away. And I suppose I should explain this before it gets out of hand in the comments. Yep, yeah, it is raining. Um, here I've got any eye. It's got cheat mode off. So I can't give myself items, but I can press... Yeah, we'll do this one. Ah, and it will give me the recipe for the item, so... That's the, why I've got that there. Is it a lightning storm too? That'll be interesting. You must have understand enough. Let's see, I'll just keep gathering some wood. I noticed I can see some mountains over in this direction, so... And another thing that I realised I need is sheep. So I'm going to head over here and see if I can find any. Because pine forests don't have sheep, and deserts don't have sheep, so... Yeah, we'll see what we can find up here. Ooh, nice. I can see a, um oil spring over there and when they spread out of the ground like that it means that they have a larger deposit underneath so that's very good and a chicken I haven't seen any sheep yet though I don't need chickens unfortunately actually this looks like a plain plains area biome and plains normally have sheep so might get lucky here bingo it hasn't even been long. We found enough sheep here to make ourselves a bed. Which is very, very good. And unfortunately I don't have iron yet, so I can't make shears, so I have to kill them one by one. Let's see what else. Oh, looks like <laughs> a tiny volcano over here. That's nice, I guess. Volcano volcanoes are cool. Yeah, some nice oil sitting just there. And one of the other things I want to find is the swamp biome. Now it probably sounds like I'm just getting picky, but swamp biomes usually hold a lot of rubber trees. And I need rubber to start off to get started in industrial craft, so that's going to be an issue. Let's kill this last piggy. I notice the white thing coming out of their heads whenever I attack them, so I don't know what that's all about. I think I might spend the night on this on these planes here. I'll um, let's grab a few more dirt blocks quickly. I might show you this part. And so I need to that, that, oh, for a second I thought I didn't have it, my last piece of wool, that was scary for a second, and I should be able to sleep, if I can get into the bed, there we are, good, that's three quarter of moon just there. 
So now that that's over with, I can tear this down and go back. Just thought I'd show you guys my process just there. I'll also grab the skull, the bones these skeletons drop actually. And we better have three pieces, come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Yes! Oh, phew. Now we could smelt that iron, give ourselves an iron pick. Oh, it's probably a bit dark for you right now. Uh, give ourselves an iron pick. And then we can mine that ruby and start using ruby tools instead of dodgy little stone ones. So that was my purpose of coming down here again, because I still need to mine some more sand. Now I can head back up, smelt this iron, and finally gather that ruby stuff. Whee! Okay. Ruby for the win. I'm hoping there's enough here for... Yes, I can make a shovel as well. That will make my sand mining a tad quicker. Yay! I'm happy about that. I don't know why it took so long to find iron, though. That was kind of frustrating. I just see some coal. Well, that must have been my eyes playing with me. Anyway. So making ruby tools is almost no different to making any other tools, just using the rubies in place of the other materials. I'm going to make myself a chest here as well. And I might move you guys to my makeshift house. Oops, get you there, and... Oh, something I didn't haven't showed you guys yet. I've got an inventory mod where I can go... Ah, uh, and it will organize everything in my inventory. I'll also do the same thing for chests. Which is very handy. I'm just going to put, like, pretty much everything in here for now. Not you. Not you. Oh, yes, you. Not you, not you, not you. Yeah, that seems dandy. There we go. Now I'm starting to get set up here. So if I show you digging somewhere with the shovel. Yeah, that's way better than digging with a uh, silly stone. So anyway, I'll keep mining the sand and then I'll be able to grab some more sandstone to build my house. And finally get a complete room done. That would be a nice feeling, won't it? And it's turning night time. And that was a bit of a lag spike there. Obviously, I've already told you it's to be expected. I'll grab two more pieces of sand to make this even. We've got another 50 pieces. And I wonder if I'll be able to... Nah, I won't be able to probably be able to get a roof on this house, but... It's something, I guess. Actually, I might try sleeping before monsters start spawning. Yes! Good. Actually, I want to move my bed, so that won't be my spawn point for now. I'll put in there. Anyway, I'll just keep building my house. Oh, well, there was a, there was a, actually a few months of spawning already. Ah. So as I was saying before with the chest, can't remember if I showed you this or not, but I can click and I can organize everything in a certain manner. So I can have it rows, columns zigzag and this is just options for this that mod not important for now um i'll have it like that for now looks pretty also made myself a door nice and easy and i'll keep mining more sand i guess just as i start recording i'm sure you guys might have seen this creeper and i just failed at fighting him good on me okay so obviously by the durability of my shovel here I've done a bit more sand mining. Um, ooh, not a nice amount of sand. Might grab 24 more pieces though. Just to make an even stack of sandstone that I can get myself. I like even stacks. So obviously i still got a lot more sand mining to do, but I think I'll go underground mining before I do that more. Um, I was going to do a flat roof, but then I decided... I might as well add some depth to it. I'm not 
any in any way a creative or good looking builder. And so my houses always end up boring and ugly, but I don't know. Might try something different in this series. Yeah, we'll see how things go, I think. <laughs> ah, more ruby. I wonder why I'm finding a lot more ruby than anything else at the moment. Usually it's pretty even, like the amount of stuff that I find. Like, compared to sapphire... Oh, jeez! It's probably from the same vein, actually. I just didn't look it up properly. But I did find a cave. Nice. End of the skeleton. Who's... What? What? There must be two. Come on, come on. Oh, that's what it was. And they're both just nodding their heads at me, all laughing. I'll, I'll say they're laughing. <laughs> I was wondering why that skeleton was hitting me so much. That caught me off guard, actually. No, um, I can't remember what happened there. But as you can see, this is where I spawned. The desert's in this direction, so I'll just head back there now. Not a big deal. In the big scheme of things, definitely. Back to approaching my house here. And I just wanted to show you something that I actually find pretty fun. Well, not fun, but just fun, yeah, fun to do. Sprinting down these stairs. I don't know why. But it's cool. Grab my stuff. I wonder where the monsters went. Oh well. Something I might have to change is it automatically doesn't put things that I pick up in my hotbar, and I don't really like that. That's something I'll have to look up on how to change, but besides that, it's all good. Let's see, anything in this cave now? Obviously I haven't got any armor. Okay, this is fairly extensive. I'm going to have to go some do some spelunking, which is always good fun. It looks like it stops here. It probably extends behind that gravel, but I'll leave that for a later date. In the meantime, I'll just clear out this cave of resources. Yummy! Ooh! No, that's not diamond. It's something that's a part of red power that's called nickelite. As you can see, it looks a bit like redstone, and it's used in, um, as, what am I saying? As red power's energy uh, source sort of thing. And all of Red Power's energy type stuff, it's used, so... I think that's what I was trying to say. So I've cleared out this direction of minerals, and just going to go this way for a little bit and see what I can find. So I've just been following the same cave, and it looks like it's just splitting up in two directions here. Looks like I've found some lapis, and over here, I saw before... I've got some... Emerald! Which is another one of those gems that I'm strange that I'm not actually finding more of. Oh, well, it's not strange that I'm finding the amount that I have been. It's just strange that I've been finding only ruby. But I think I'll end the episode here, guys. Uh, thank you for watching. And I don't normally don't normally do this, but comment if you do want to see more because it is a bit of a pain to record with the slow frames per second, but. You know, I'm doing my best because, and I, I'm still trying to fix it. No idea why. I've tried just about everything that I th could think of, besides installing Optifine, which I might have to go and do. Um, yeah, thank you for watching. Oh, sapphire. Minerals everywhere. I hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you next time.